One of the themes, storylines, and contributing factors to this year's run to the FCS National Championship for the Montana Grizzlies is health. It feels obvious to say, but it's true. Without a healthy team, the Grizzlies, or anyone, don't make deep playoff runs. You know, I think we could have been sitting here in 21 and 22, potentially, if we'd stayed healthy, but we didn't. So it was, it was uh, certainly productive for us to be healthy. So what's been the difference? Naturally, a number of factors, but some come to the forefront. Dan Ryan and kind of Coach Hell kind of came up with a, a real plan to really hit on our soft tissue, like the little hammy injuries, the kind of our quad, and when things really get tight, we kind of hit those in the weight room now, which we kind of really didn't really hit as much in the past, and I think that's really showed this season. Nash Fouch and Alex Gubner have played in every game for the Grizzlies since the 2019 season, with next week's national championship set to be Fouch's 57th game and Gubner's 58th. You learn, I think, as you get through college uh, with football, how to take care of your body, nutrition, or just stretching and sleep, just all these things that help you with performance. You get a lot of older guys, too, that you come up with, and you see how hard they prepare physically for a game. Off-season work and the weight room has been key for things like mobility and longevity as the Grizzlies built up their bodies. I think the weight room's been the biggest thing for me just because we, we work so much. I mean, we, we work speed and we work heavy lifts all the time, but it's just, it's just as important, if not more important, during the season to work on the mobility and stuff at the same time. And I think through the course of my career, I've tried to be pretty good about it, and I think, you know, it showed. Trey John Cotton also hasn't missed a fall game at UM since he arrived three years ago. Cotton battled injuries at Oregon State, but since, it's the attention to details of preservation that have helped Cotton stay ready in Missoula. Just the commitment to the training room. I go in the training room after every lift and cold tub and ice tub, and I do it after practice as well. I do it twice. They call me an old man because I be in the training room so much and using the cold tubs and things like that, but it, it's got me here this long. Stretching, hydration, recovery, you've heard it before, but it works. You got to take care of yourself if you're playing a lot of snaps, ice bath, Normatex, even the sauna. A lot of us get in the saunas here. But at the end of the day, just because, you know, you're not missing games, you're still hurting. And we get creative here. And there's other guys like Garrett Graves, Braxton Hill, Tyler Flink, Corbin Walker, and A.J. Forbes, who have all sparingly missed games in their careers and have played in 50 or more at Montana. Of course, some luck is also involved to get through a full season and there's bumps and bruises along the way. But games are special because of their limited number, and this year's Grizz team has done everything in their power to make sure they're available when Saturdays roll around, and the work they've put in has paid off in the long run. Most of my best experiences in life have happened in here, and to miss one of those would just suck. So I think it's been really cool for me. It's been really cool for a lot of guys. I mean, like, like Gubby and TC, too, and some other guys. It's just it's really cool to come out here every Saturday and do this, and to miss one would just be a shame. So I'm glad it turned out the way it did. Reporting in Missoula, Kyle Hansen, MTN Sports.